Scorpio love reading so far you have a earth sign Capricorn Virgo or Taurus that wants to take you somewhere Scorpio you also have a mother or an ex lover or baby mother that wants to be back in your life they want to come around and seal the deal and 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 be that person your, your significant person I'm also seeing pentacles a lot of it Scorpio, beautiful soul, you are someone's wish fulfillment, dream come true. You are getting your wish fulfillment also. You're getting what you want. It is coming in quickly, quicker than you thought um, or you expected. You're going to get your dream come true and someone is someone just admires you so much, highly admires and appreciates you, Scorpio, and is thinking about you. You are someone's dream person. You're like someone's forever dream person. They think about you. They talk about you with others. You fill them up with feelings of goodness and love and you make them feel happy. Scorpio, so this person, they love you a lot. They admire you. I feel like this person admires everything about you like this person they will write home about you yeah you're something to write home about this person favors you admires you cares about you loves you so much so you could be dealing with a scorpio energy a fellow scarp a fellow water sign a cancerian with the death card i'm seeing new beginnings and things coming to light i'm feeling like you're getting to recognize that someone cares about you a lot like you are someone's chosen person i hear epiglottis this card says i love you you're getting to realize that some someone has a picture of you that they look at you they think about you they're emotionally connected with you now this could be a mother energy or a baby mother or someone of your past someone that you used to work with this could be a woman that has a child or something like this but someone um is really coming to a recognition a feeling a fullness you know when something is just being filled up in spirit that they admire you they love you you're beautiful you are they're just someone is just realizing some goodness in you and they love you someone is someone cares about you someone wants to be your dream person just they look at you with such fullness in their eyes like you are the person that they want i feel like you're about to have a beautiful marvelous day you are blessed blessed things happen around you surround you in and out I feel you should just give thanks. You're a supreme being. The universe and God is within you. I'm feeling powerfully. A po you are a powerful presence. You're magnificent. You're amazing. You're like out of a storybook. You are so real. You are everything. Someone is just really into you a lot. You're like a story someone will tell. You're a part of someone's history. You're part of someone's life. So this could be someone that is in your life. This person is dreaming about you. This person, they have not gotten over you and they will not get over you. Like you are the story of someone's life. They're talking you into being. I hear something, a resistance, right? They, they think you may be resisting, but they are, they are not going to stop until they find the answer, the key that, key that opens your heart. Someone is not going to stop pursuing you until they get access to you, until they find you, until they see you again, until they come closer to you, until they make, they want to get close and feel that energy that um, is between both of you again. Someone wants to re resonate, someone wants to bask in your energy again, someone wants to feel your glow again, someone wants to know what that it feels like to be in your presence. It was one of the realest moments that you've impressed someone so much, Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a Gemini. This person is dreaming about you. They're so captivated by you. For real, like it's like you're the story of someone's life. I said it already, but if that's how it is feeling, like someone they could sit down and journal about you, write books about you. You've taken over someone's heart, aura. They're talking to this the gods about you. You're in someone's dreams. You're all over someone's world, someone's mind. You are, you're connecting with this person on different realms. In this realm, in the sleep realm, in some other realm. 
this person is thinking about the past with you the future with you the now with you that's how i'm feeling like what's going on in a love connection you are you are just so inspiring you've just marveled someone you could be an artist i hear memoir someone has read something of you they've gotten a taste of your life or some insight into your life you could write books you could be an author someone is seeing you as special this could be like obsession because this person may have they may collect things of yours and keep them scorpio energy someone is deeply into you i feel like you're not even so aware of how the impressive you are to this person for real i hear shadow this person they're following you they're they're, they're always eyeing you i'm not no i'm not sure if this person is going to come out of the dark one day if you're going to see them if they're going to be revealed to you but just know the great impact that you have on someone you could be a celebrity all right or someone that has some fame or notoriety they're just impressed by you being a bad you know what full of life someone just likes what you do they like the way you move you're full of love and possibilities you have big dreams you resonate with this person it's like you speak to them you speak their story you speak their life you could be a reader or this person is this person is feeling like they know you. They've connected with you on different lifetimes in the past. They think when you're talking with them, you're reminding them or when you're talking to them, you remind them of some feeling of a long time of ago. What do you call that? Okay. You're one of the realest and truest things to someone. Imagine if there was a world of where fairies existed years ago, but then we would say fairies got extinct because of um the evolution our whole life got more filled with toxic substances the fairies couldn't survive so like there was an endangered species of some some energy i don't know who they are fairies vampires gnomes but imagine someone wants to write you a letter okay this person they're in a distance and they want to send they want to connect with you across distant lands like so they want to talk with you so imagine if this person recognizes that spirit in you that they thought was forever lost like they recognized like this person is feeling like they're a fairy maybe they don't know who they are or what they are because they their generation or their species has been somehow wiped out their identity has been somehow wiped out but they their soul they know their soul maybe they can't put it into words but they know their soul feeling yeah you're this person this person is feeling like you're their soul mate you're their soul family you speak their language on bigger things so this person they want to write you letters to let you know this may be like a fan or this person is feeling like they're a fan of yours okay so the, the things that you talk about makes this person feel like if you've been in their soul before if you've known their soul family if you could have any idea about the fairies the light your past life and stuff like that yeah okay this person, someone is dealing with a lot. This is the five of wands. Someone is dealing with drama and conflict. Um, but it's it's over. It's no more. You may not be involved in it. Someone is definitely writing someone a letter. Dear something something. Writing a letter from a distance. Three of number three traveling. Someone may be feeling ostracized from their family. And yeah, whoa, the ten of diamonds. Someone may be feeling ostracized from their family and longing for real connection and trueness as they soul search. Five. This is my family card. Family tree. No, you're moving into some greatness. I hear greatness potential. You're moving into blessings and wealth, fortune, prosperity. Dream come true life, Scorpio. This is my deja vu card. Twin flame card. You're taking your power back from some narcissistic vibrations that were of your past that told you lies, that told you mis that misled you, and then they got upset when you found out the truth and you started to speak the truth. This is like um 
the gin um what is that called the gingerbread host move um fairy tale with the stepmother energy i hear someone was keeping something from someone all all this time all their life and then when this person found out the truth they can and spoke the truth they kind of like try to make you feel guilty make you feel bad so you got ostracized so someone is sitting up on a mountainside writing their hearts out you are being listened to yeah what you're waiting for is coming through and someone is waiting for you too look six of cups this could be the energy of a father and someone passing away maybe a father energy um you're going to get some clarity something is being restored they were trying to hide some things i hear wand as in a, a wand i hear so we have the nine of cups your happiness completion success and love coming around to you again here in your life fulfillment and someone felt lost but you're going to be feeling better accomplished you're going to be feeling more you're recovering what you feel like was lost and we have the magician card on the bottom of the deck scorpio so for sure someone was doing some candle magic or spells but they backfired. They did not work. That is why you were feeling how you were feeling. Someone wanted someone was jealous and wanted to compete with you. But and this has to do with your dreams, like your literal dreams. You are right you may be writing to someone about this. Yeah, but you're I'm telling you, you're seeking some help and it's it is coming true. Alright, you're taking your power back and someone is being exposed. But they don't like it. That fairy tale energy, jealousy, that step step person energy. They don't like that you know the truth. They may send you a message or a warning, a threat in some way, right? They may try to tell you to stop doing something because they're afraid and they they want you in fear. But you are not in fear. You are in love. You are a dominant. You're not despairing. They wanted you to be despairing right but you have a lot of answers and you're finding out some truth you're getting the vision you have great vision and your ancestors are working with you you could be connected to the pyramids and the egypt egypts and the pyramids right you're by, by powerful forces okay so you're actually leveling up and moving forward away from what was keeping you down stuck you're moving into freedom you're ascending and someone is admiring that about you someone is appreciating your, your power your strength your confidence your ascension but there could have been some family energies burr root burdock burr something yeah look the tree and this is my family card too where people talk about you plan up against you the number three burdock roots all right, evidence, shalom, in the goiter, moon card. You're, and it, whatever, um, if there were spells, it's being exercised off of you. Uh, someone's manipulation is not effective anymore. And they're upset because it's being, whatever, restraints were, are lifted up off of you. And they were heavy. They were heavy. Whatever they were trying to put onto you, it's going onto them. They're being, someone is being crushed. Because they're being found out. Sun card. You must live to shine. Imagine someone wanted to snuff your light out. Imagine this is arm wrestling. Someone was put, pulling you down, down, you know. And they were like, hee, 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 hee. And then some way, somehow, Scorpio, you started to put it back onto this person. With, this, with the light of the sun behind you. And the ace of swords energy. And this person, they don't like it. But that is the way it is meant to be because in the other way, it was not fair. You had to come out and show your strength. Show that you are aware, you have knowledge, you have power, master key energy, number 27, number 9 energy, 33, 69, 369. Power, magical powers, gifts. You are a shaman. You are a prophet. Alright, so take it easy out there. All is well and all is within you. Much love. Bye. You may be a reporter. A news reader, a channeler, something.